Michael with MMA Island here with Yuri Prohaska. You guys must have seen the knockout of UFC 251. Crazy, crazy fight, man. Yuri, how are you, bro? Hi, I'm great. Glad to hear, man. I saw you posted on your Instagram story. You were at the lake. Was that how the day was spent? Were you working out or just how was the day spent today? Uh, today, I had uh, just a uh, just little chill morning and uh, after that, I had some trainings, some trainings, meditation, and a little swimming in lake in the, in the, my village. That's awesome, man. So, have you been? Have you been taking it? E have you been taking it easy, or are you still keeping the training training regimen going after uh, your fight? I'm, I'm, I'm working uh, every my every my training. I take uh, like in, important, very important, but but. Uh, how I feel. Sometimes I go, I'm going hard, very hard. Sometimes I'm going easily. How I feel. And today was uh, one half was hard, one half, and other, 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 and other training. The swimming was a little easily, easy. Yeah. Easy. So looking at the whole trip to Abu Dhabi, uh, talk to me what that whole process was like. It's you've never, I'm sure you've never experienced a fight uh, build up like that before. What you asking? What you asking? So just, just the trip, the whole trip to Abu Dhabi. Just explain to me what that was like. Uh, it was very uh, <laughs> new experience for me. New experience and. Uh, I like that. I like that because it was something new. Uh, so much quarantine at times. <laughs> yeah. Uh, because before we uh, were living from uh, from England to Abu Dhabi, we 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 was at uh, we was two two three three days in quarantine in uh, in London, and then two days in Abu Dhabi. So it was a little bit, uh, it was a little, uh, different, like another time before fighting. So, but I like it. I like it. I'd like uh, to, to change something. Yeah. How is the whole fighting in the empty, empty arena? Just, just having that where you don't hear crowd noise. Like how, what was that like? Uh, normal i like it because it was like a normal training no not normal training but uh, there was a there 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 was not so much people yeah they just just the uh, cameras and uh, and the talkers <laughs> speakers and uh, i like it i like it there was a uh, uh, focus for for my opponent for everything. Yeah, so so talking about the uh, uh, your fight with Vulcan, what did what did you expect going into the fight with Vulcan? What I, what I expect before fight? Yeah, or, I expect uh, it will be a hard, very tough fight from 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 his side. Because he's a very, very tough guy. Uh, but I, I uh, don't know before fight uh, if he want to go to the ground or if he want to stay in a stand up, you know. And uh, that was uh, that was a little, a little big question for me and uh, I, it was like it was <laughs> yeah so getting your first fight in the UFC you get a you get a, the performance bonus how did it feel when you found out you got the uh, performance bonus normal <laughs> normal no, no not normal but but uh, I know my style and my my fighting is it's like uh, it's uh, it's every time Good show for people. So 
I'm glad for that, for the bonus. And uh, <laughs> nothing. And uh, everything's good. <laughs> Yeah, so so I, I heard in your post fight interview you were saying that you feel you made some mistakes. Well, what do you what in your words? What would you think you did wrong? Yes, yes, there was so much punches to my head uh, from from the from uh, from the start in fight. Uh, my movement, uh, my head head movement was uh, so slowly, and uh, my hand hands was slow, so slow, because uh, I I think a lot for, uh, when I was in the fight from the from from the start in first round, I was thinking about uh, to knock knock him down, you know, to to punch him so so hard. And uh, that was the mistake. I need to keep my mind uh, pure, pure, and uh, no, th no thinking for 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 some knockout or something like that. And uh, I will, uh, I will succeed in the second rounds about that. Well, you, well, you definitely succeeded in the second round. I think other than obviously the amazing knockout, people were talking about saying your style was weird. Uh, uh, what, what, talk to me a little bit about the hand gestures. You were, you were bumping your chest. You were talking to him. What, tell me what that is for you. I don't take it like, uh, like something weird because, because for me it's normal. And uh, I feel, I feel that I, I just, I'm, I'm just listening my body. Yes, and uh, this is uh, this is this is me. This is just this is just me. And uh, I was I was I was thinking about my technique all my car all, my, all the time all the time in my career. So now I think I still. I'm, I like to to do s still some upgrades in my style, yeah, and uh, that's why I'm now that's why I'm now fighting like I'm fighting. That's good, man. And then you, you you got they talked to you in the post fight interview saying I'm talking about John Jones. You showed your respect to John Jones. You said maybe I I probably won't fight him next. You said you want to learn a little bit. But do you think someday, someday you will fight John Jones? Maybe, maybe I, I believe that. I believe that. Maybe, yeah. Why not? <laughs> so, being ranked now, who who do you want to fight next? Is, is a better question to ask rather than talking about the champion. Doesn't doesn't matter. In my in my division, is every guy is uh, every guy is for me. Uh, I'm saying. Uh, I like every guys. Uh, I think I, I I mean the style. I mean the style. I, I I like every guys in my division. So now it doesn't matter who, who will be the next opponent. Yeah, they're all tough opponents, especially getting your UFC UFC d debut against Vulcan, who's a very tough opponent. Did you yeah. kind of? Like, did you kind of be like, wait, maybe I shouldn't get Vulcan to get my UFC debut? Was there any hesitation? What? What you asking? Like, were you not? Did you not want to go after Vulcan for your first fight, or was there yeah. no? That was the good step from from UFC to me, but uh, I think I had good position from uh, from rising from rising because I defend the title. I have. The good wins on the win streak, yeah, something like that. And uh, that was the very nice step from from US, and I, I'm respect that. I'm happy for that. Yeah, and and man, I, I think one your knockout streak that's going currently for you is one of the greatest in in MMA I can think of up, off the top of my head. Was there any pressure uh, to keep your knockout streak going heading into this fight with Volkan Uzdemir? Sorry? 
so so your your knockout your knockout streak was there any was there was there any pressure to to keep the knockout streak going no I, no no definitely not you man you got the power where do you think you rank in the division power wise what what you, what what are you asking so your your pa- your power in the in the in the UFC lightweight division do you think you're one of yeah. the hardest hitters in the in that division yes sure <laughs> because i I'm, I'm 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 working on 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 uh on that power from my start from my starting the fighting i was i was a little crazy i was a little crazy when i started the fighting uh i have just my i have every i had every every week i had one training for 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 hard punches yes every every sunday this today is sunday and every every sunday i had uh, to train i had special training for to for hard hard punches and uh, after much years after much years i understand that uh, it's not just about uh, to keep some weight in hand and uh, do and do some hard punches but it's it's more about technique about more more about uh, body works about uh, the use my energy to punch about breathing about uh, the about my core about my stomach you understand and yeah. uh and uh that's my that's my way i like it i like that to work with on that yeah, and, and and going back to you talking about the trip to Abu Dhabi, you you said you got to drive the fast cars in Abu Dhabi. Talk yeah. to me about that. Uh, we tried some Aston Martin and some other other cars uh, for for drifting and uh, and uh, fast fast uh, racing. So, so it was it was a nice uh, experience for me and. Uh, uh, it's, it was good to to keep my mind free yes to keep my mind uh, pure uh, before fight I like I like that I like do the, this this uh, these things before fight because so, I was ready I was ready uh, and I just want to stay happy before fight yeah and, and it showed, it played up for your for your fight with Vulcan and man man just People are looking to see you fight again, having put up such a great performance. When yeah. do you think you're fighting next? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I think uh, one, two uh, month now will be a little bit easily, for a little, little easily. But I'm uh, still working on on my on on this on my plans uh, to fighting. So. I I never have uh, the full full uh, full pause full how to say full uh, uh, nothing to do. So so I think after after two three months I I want to to fight next again. Yeah. So if the UFC came to you and said like we need someone to fill in and they want you, you'd say yes if it was in the next couple of months. Yes. All right. Well, man, like I said before, people are looking to see you back in the octagon. Uh, actually, I, I wanted to bring this up to you. So I heard people say that 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 you you said no to get into the UFC before you came in. So so the UFC wanted you in the UFC and you said no and you stayed with Ryzen for a little bit. What was that decision like? Uh, that was that was that was because uh, I need I, the, when I say when I said that uh, I was need some some more experiences in fighting to be better to be better fighter to be to be ready for for uh, for the UFC level. Yes, and yeah. uh, I I talk with my coaches. Uh, 
uh, I talk with my coaches all the time about these these things, and uh, that was uh, very good. I think that was good decision about that. Yeah. Because because the rising was prepared was uh, prepared me. Rising prepared me for the UFC level. Yes, and uh, I'm glad for that. Yeah, man, and, and I think a lot of people can respect that uh, of you for saying like like when that you want to wait to get into the UFC and you want to wait to fight John Jones as well. Uh, gonna let you go here, man. I want I want to just lead it, end it off with one last thing for the people who haven't seen you fight yet. What can they expect when they see you fight? What what do you what you ask? What what can people expect to see when you fight next? If people who haven't seen you fight yet, ah. what? Okay, I okay. Uh, they can expect just that I will be better. I will be better. Uh, not not so much dangerous position like now, like like this time. And uh, uh, I want to take it to this the next fights. I want to take it to my hand uh, more quickly than uh, than uh, second round. <laughs> All right, man. Well, I appreciate you taking the time, man. I really, really do appreciate it a lot. Thank you. For, thank you for joining. Thank you. See you.